Hi guys, this is the third video. I'm going to focus on how the proposed amendment called the Smoke-Free Environments and Regulated Products Vaping Amendment Bill is intended to phase out completely all tobacco and vaping import and sale in New Zealand. Now, in order to do that, I need to introduce you to a concept of the sinking lid. The in proposed law embeds within it, without using the words, a structure which is basically a sinking lid policy. And I will, over these few videos, I'll explain how they do this and where it is in the Act. So the very good document for you to have a look at is this uh, one on quota management policy for New Zealand tobacco supply. And this explains what a sinking lid policy is. It's basically a quota management system, similar to what we have for managing fisheries. We have a quota management system to protect the number of fish that are being pulled out of the sea. So what will happen is that the Act provides for the establishment of a system whereby the Director General of the Ministry of Health can gradually, so first you'll set a ceiling, let's say there's 200 specialist vape shops in New Zealand. We're going to start with that number, and then he can, over the years or months or however long he likes, because it's totally left up to him in the Act, he can decide to go, well, I'm only going to uh, give a licence to or allow uh, or approve an application from, you know, 200 this year, Next year I'm going to cut it to 150, the year after it will drop down to 100, you get the, the gist. So anyone who wants to be a specialist vape store will need to apply and it is totally up to one person, the Director General of the Ministry of Health. Everything, almost everything in the Act is up to him and at his whim and he can decide whether or not your business will survive and he can decide how long he will take to eradicate you. I um, want to keep these short so I'll cut it there and uh, I'll explain more sort of frightening aspects of the amendment in the next video. I just do want to say I'm not a lawyer and uh, I would encourage you to get a lawyer's opinion on the Act as well and how it's going to impact your business or your uh, ability to vape in New Zealand going forward. Kia ora koutou.